If there is one question which a lot of Nigerian online advertisers ask frequently, then that would be how to add money to your ad account. As you already know that um, Nigerian cards are most at times rejected by the Facebook ad platform, so there should be an alternative means of paying for your ads, which is funding your ad credit wallet. Hi, my name is Kenneth Benjamin and in this very short training, I'm going to show you how to enable the pay you option so you can fund your ad account and use the funds in there to run adverts rather than running the adverts from your card which you've saved in your ad account payment method. And one thing I like about this payment method is you get to spend exactly what you budgeted for your advert. So you fund that particular amount on your ad wallet and then you use it for your adverts. So without saying much, I'm going to attempt adding a payment method. As you can see, this is a new advert account slash business account. So under business settings and the way you get to business settings is you click on this menu here and then you can see business settings over here. So you click on to get to this point, so then you click on payment. So I want to show you that if I click add payment method, this will bring up the credit or debit card window for me to add my card. And as you already know, most times adding a Naira MasterCard or Visa card would likely get rejected and you will get frustrated and you feel you can't pay for Facebook adverts. Or you might want to opt in to the Butter by Fluter Wave option, like getting a virtual card. You really don't need to do all of that. If you get stuck with adding your card, if you really want to use your card for adverts, then I think you might consider the next option, which I'm going to show you in a bit. So despite the fact that I have my billing country set as Naira and my currency set as Nigeria Naira, I still get presented with this new credit or debit card option, which would likely reject my card. So I'm going to cancel this out and then what I normally do for a new advert account is I would start creating ads immediately even without the payment method being added and by doing so I would unlock the local payment method. So let me show you what I mean. I would switch over to the next tab which already I've created the ads and then so I'm at the final step of you know publishing the ad as you can see here but I decided to make this video because I know some people are still not familiar with topping up their credit wallet for adverts. Don't mind me, I like calling it credit wallet. I don't know if that's what it is, but to me, it is a credit wallet. So before I continue, I'm going to go back to my ad set and I will adjust the start time. As you can see, the it says the start date is in the past. So. So I've gotten that out of the way, so I'll go back to my ad. You know there are three levels when you're creating Facebook adverts. There's the campaign level, there's the ad set level, and there's the ad level. So I've done all of this, so I'm in the ad level right now. So most times I'll click on publish even without the payment method set. So this will trigger, you understand, set up your ad account. It will ask me account country which is Nigeria, currency, Naira, and my time zone is Africa, Lagos. So clicking on continue would also bring up that same window we saw in the previous screen where we would need to add our credit or debit card. And as you can see, local cards is now being activated because it has given us an option. Most times you won't see local cards here. So if that is the case, I'll show you another way to go about it. So if you cannot see local cards below the credit or debit card option, then cancel it out, go over here to the menu, click on it, and then click on to billing. So you can open this in a new tab, so you don't go out of your advert window. So while it opens in a new tab, you can see here that this account doesn't have any transaction, you understand? So you look over here to where it says prepaid balance, zero naira. Click on payment settings and when payment setting loads up it will ask you to add money and most times again you won't see this option what you might see is add a payment method so if you click on that 
add a payment method then definitely you're going to see that local card option there okay i'm going to go ahead and add money since this has already been activated on my account then i'll choose the local cards option then i'll click on continue now here it says add money to your balance using local cards i plan to add 10,000 naira because that's the budget for this advert then i'll click on review payment make payment Now, PayU is a third-party payment processing company that Facebook uses to get you to add money to your balance or credit wallet as I would call it. So I'll click on continue. So this will open up a window where you can add your Naira, Mastercard, Visa or Verve card as you can see the card issuers logos that are accepted here. So normally, as you would on any website that accepts payment, you need to enter your card number card holder name, the expiry dates, and then the CVV number, the three digit number at the back of your ATM card, and then we click on pay 10,000 naira. So it's processing. It has successfully connected to my bank. I'm using GT Bank. So I would like to receive the OTP via my phone number or email. Then I click on submit. Okay, I just got the OTP and I will enter it in here and click on submit. Alright, the transaction was successful and I'll click on continue. Alright, as you can see, our balance of 10,000 naira has been credited to our account. Then I can go back to my ads and then I can publish my advert. So it's publishing. Okay, so as you can see here our ad is now currently in review which means the payment has been set and our ad has been published so i would wait for the review and then hopefully my advert will be out there saved to my target audience so i hope you liked this video don't forget to subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this i talk about facebook advertising i talk about online business and also i talk about tech related stuff that helps you manage and grow your business also if you'd like to check out my facebook ads course it's a detailed facebook ad training if you are a novice i would recommend you take that course even if you are an intermediate advertiser you've been running ads before i would also recommend you take the course as well you can check for it in the link i put in the description there to the course so i started from scratch took you all the way from creating a facebook account creating a page up until you get to the part where you start running adverts like a professional installing pixels and doing custom audiences lookalike audiences and all this stuff so i would recommend you check out the training and enroll all right friends so this is where i end this training for now and i'll see you in my next training bye bye